Pre-Science Lessons Enzymes and Digestion Digestive enzymes break down big molecules. Starch, proteins and fats are big molecules. They are too big to pass through the walls of the digestive system. So digestive enzymes break these big molecules down into smaller ones like sugars, amino acids, glycerol and fatty acids. These smaller, soluble molecules can pass easily through the walls of the digestive system, allowing them to be absorbed in the bloodstream. The body makes good use of the products of digestion. They can be used to make new carbohydrates, proteins and lipids. Some of the glucose that is made is used in respiration. Carbohydrates convert carbohydrates into simple sugars. Amylase is an example of a carbohydrate. It breaks down starch. Amylase is made in three places, the salivary glands, the pancreas and the small intestine. Proteases convert proteins into amino acids. Proteases are made in three places, the stomach, the pancreas and the small intestine. Lipases convert lipids into glycerol and fatty acids. Lipases are made in two places, the pancreas and the small intestine. Digestive enzymes break down big molecules. Bile is produced in the liver. It is stored in the gallbladder before it is released into the small intestine. The hydrochloric acid in the stomach makes the pH too acidic for enzymes in the small intestine to work properly. Bile is alkaline. It neutralizes the acid and makes conditions alkaline. The enzymes in the small intestine work best in these alkaline conditions. It emulsifies fats. In other words, it breaks the fat into tiny droplets. This gives a much bigger surface area of fat for the enzyme lipase to work on, which makes its digestion faster. If you haven't already, please subscribe, like and share.